Okay. Now, can we please have the inner circle stand up and move one chair to your right? Thank you. And now I'll hand you over to Jaji, who will take over the questions. Hi, everybody. Most of you know me. My name is Jaji Manavala. I'm the artistic director of ZU UK and also one of the lead artists. Um, so the first question in our speed dating today is what is the most important exchange that happens in a collaboration? What is the most important exchange that happens in a collaboration? It's an inner circle for one minute. Um, oh, um, well, finding out about someone else's practice and finding out what relates to what I already do and finding out what doesn't. Yes, learning about the exchange that happens. And it can be sometimes effective, it can be sometimes of discovering new things that you want to do, but you didn't know that you wanted. Exchanging them, properly exchanging them, so that each person changes. I, I am no longer the person from my disciplinary background with my history. I am all of that, plus the insights that I've gained from seeing how another person sees the world. So yeah, that's what I would say, definitely. Yeah. Just sort of create something which wasn't quite there. Okay, and you're going to stop in your mid-flow, and the person on the outer circle is going to start. Not only the professional knowledge, but also like uh, their personal knowledge as well. You know, like because working as a doctor leads to another way of thinking. Okay, thank you. And oh, we have an outer circle stand up. So outer circle stand up, please, and one to your left. To your right. The other left. Okay, so, oh, hold on. so your next question is, name a time or speak to a time uh, where you were involved in a successful collaboration. So name or speak to a time where you were involved in a successful collaboration. So in outer circle starting, one minute. work quite often with um, uh, media specialists and we did um, a project uh, called Market to Parkside where we um, filmed residents of a housing estate that the residents themselves had decided needed to come down and lobbied the council and then they themselves um, basically tendered it out once they had the money to housing associations and chose which housing association they were going to go, go with. But we did this uh, project and we um, developed lots of different ways of taking photographs, doing audio interviews and working with the residents to create um, an installation. In Okay, and now the inner circle, inner circle, one minute, go. Um, I don't know if I've done many collaborations really. Um, one, one I did, um, I was asked to do a series of workshops. 
and what I'm thinking, I had many actually, because I work with curating, so every time I'm trying to do something in this aspect, I have to have people working with together, because if I'm going to, to make a show, for example, I need people to share with me uh, their artwork, I need to be open to discuss and to collaborate with them. So I have a recent uh, experience as well, it was last year, where I set up a show in the Brazilian Embassy. Uh, it was a pop-up art show with two artists and a co-curator with me. It was very successful because we were working together and we called the show on Bobby. So the idea was somewhere else. So I said, well, I don't want to take any care of Okay. Now, the inner circle, please stand up and move one to your right. Thank you. And now we're going to have the next question. Oh, well, there's some people that haven't found their seats yet. There we go. Uh, name a time or speak to a time when a collaboration you were part of was a total disaster <laughs> and went really badly wrong. So I don't know what which circle's going first. We're going to go with the inside circle. Okay, so inside circle, off you go. Inside circle, one minute. Um, okay. Me speaking? Yeah, you listening? So yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Yes, thank you. This is the cat, by the way. Uh, it's a small cat. It's too small. It's very, it's very small and doesn't ca cannot capture it too much. Huh? <laughs> yeah, I use. I use, oh, I, I, I use a similar one for filming. Um, well, um, I, 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 I do not recall any moment when I had a project. You did your research and they go, well, have you thought of this? And they go, no. Because it might be like that. That's a silly question. But then somebody else would go, well, it's not that silly. You should probably look into that. And they send you back, you spend another two weeks going, okay, it was silly. <laughs> go back, try again, and somebody else would go, oh, I'm glad you thought of that, but I thought of another idea. Yeah, could one of your be because of this? Like, just wait for it. Well, it's like, okay, all right, I think I might just have to come up with something. Off we go. So, yeah, but the good thing about it, we came up with some really cool projects individual, which is true. If you thought about it, if we put them together, we could have come up with something. And now, outer circle, one minute, and go. Okay, um, so we were recognising like actual theatre. So I'm um, currently doing a master at UEL at the moment. And I would say for me, I can't think of like a specific project, but I, times when I'm working um, in groups and experiences. But you have, you have experience, but it's not failure, yeah, but when it doesn't really work. Sure and if do. you no recognize that things doesn't right work, else. but you can't really change it because it's actually it's 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 Simple, because you can see the way you're doing this. No, change it. Who cut a tire? Oh, my God. A Jade, a filha dele, já não sei onde ela nasceu, mas a Jade, ela é mãe. Mas ela fala português e tem duas pessoas aqui que falam inglês. E eu já fiz isso. 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 Can we have the outer circle? Please stand up and move on to your right. Okay, so this question is based on the fact um, that often I hear a lot about Oh, so and so, 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 it was a true collaboration, or oh, that, 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 that was a true collaboration. So there's often this idea that other people um, often use this phrase, a true collaboration. So I'm interested in this phrase and what it means it then if the opposite is true. So are there such things like fake collaborations if there are true ones? So um, the question really is about what do you think other people mean 
when they say something, a project was a true collaboration. Have I bamdoozled everybody into <laughs> <laughs> uh, what? What do other people mean when they talk about true collaborations? Okay, and we, yeah, what do you think other people mean? And we'll start with the outside circle, one minute. Okay, and now, in a circle, what do you think other people mean when they say something was a true collaboration? And one minute, go. Okay, can we please have the inner circle stand up and move one to your right, please. Thank you. And your next question is about um, process, uh, a collaboration based on process or collaborations based on final product. So the question really is around what, if any, are the differences between a collaboration that is based on having to have a final outcome and a collaboration that is based on a more kind of open process-led um, partnership. Okay? No? Just the question again. You don't understand the question about process-led and product-led? So what are the differences in the collaboration? What effect does it have on the, que on the collaboration if the collaboration is one that is about process or if there is something that you're working towards that you have to build or make together? So final product. Okay, is course. that better? Did, do you get it? Is it okay now? Great, cool. Okay, so we have one minute starting from the inner circle, go. Everything's already decided. That's, 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 that's teamwork, that's working together. But to me, it's less collaboration um, in the way that multiple ideas aren't being, well, maybe they are being shared about how best to make it, how best to perform the outcome. But if you've already got a final product in mind, then it always feels like everything's been decided. If maybe you have a solution to solve, a or problem to solve, and you have to come up with the problem or the solution to that problem, I can see sort of collaboration coming in there. Maybe that would be more process. Um, okay, and now same question to the outer circle. What do you think are the differences between a process that is led by process, open-ended process, or towards an outcome? Go. One minute.
Okay. So in collaborations that happen particularly across sector or across industries, this one is for, um, what, is, what are good ways in which you can negotiate the differences in the um, ways of working? So the different kinds of ways and methodologies of working, uh, particularly between different kinds of groups of people, their work rhythms, for example, or their use of particular vernacular or vocabularies. And how are, or what in your opinion, are good ways of negotiating these differences of processes? Okay, so we'll start with the outer circle. One minute, go. Some time.